Hello, today we will be hooking up an amp to our electric drums. I have a couple amps that I'm going to uh, show you on hooking them up to where they will work properly. Okay, let's do it this way first because this is the most, this is the best way. On the back of a module, drum module, or somewhere on it, you will find a right and left output. And these are just regular jacks like you would use in a guitar, single mono jacks or hookups. And you have a right and left, you just simply plug one on the right and one on the left. You will need two cords for this and you will also need a two channel amp, channel one, channel two. And you will take the other side of your cords, plug in the channel one, channel two. And that is one way of hooking an amp up and which is the best way. Okay, another way you can hook up to a uh, sound system or amp. I'm using a uh, amp, a drum amp, or a keyboard amp. A guitar amp sometimes don't work as well. So Another way you can hook your amps up is through the headphone jacks on your module on your drums. And you just simply plug it up where the headphones goes. And you will need a regular jack such as, I made this one up, but a jack such as you would use with headphones. And on the other end you will need such as the first one you use, that's the, you, like you get to our plugs, you would, the mono, uh, I think them's a one fourth, and you just simply do like before, first and second channel. That gives you the right and left on that, just as headphones, and it will kind of bring out a better sound and just hook it on one side. Although, you can uh, also, on the left side of your drum module you can do a mono and hook it up single but it don't sound as good it doesn't sound good at all in my opinion so this is another way you can hook your amp up okay now that we have our amp hooked up this is the uh, pv 8 inch 20 watt keyboard amp that i was using and this is kind of what it sounds like Now we will be hooking up our powered speaker. This is a 15 inch powered speaker, which compared to the little 8 inch PV, the PV works fine. It sounds great as you heard. But this one is a little bigger. It carries a little louder sound, a little clearer sound, and a little better sound because of the size of it. But on the back of it, you have a couple of ways of doing this. First, we're going to the input on uh, the uh, loaded speaker which would be a right and left if you're hooking a turntable or a uh, CD player or something into it. But I'm hooking my drums in that place. It's simply right in the left with the red and the black and you simply go to your drum module just like before you have a left and right you plug them up just like this and that is one way that you can hook up your powered speaker. Okay, another way we're going to hook our powered speaker up, or an amp, it works all about the same way, is, you know, guys, if we hadn't got the hang of the left and right on the uh, computer module, I mean the, the drum module, but now if we in trouble, but nevertheless, the right and the left on it. And then we are going to come to our powered speaker again, and on the back of it, this is where you would plug like a microphone or a guitar. And this has a higher output. As you can see on this one, it's maxed out to get the sound that I want out of the drum. So if you are playing in a uh, 
a bigger place or need a lot more sound, you might want to go with this setup, which is this is a split that is the size of a microphone or a uh, guitar plug, and you simply plug it in and make two. And what we will do, we will take our jacks. And we will, on both sides of them, just like on the other one, the left and the right, we will plug them in, one, and we will do the same on the other. Oh, it kind of looks like this, or actually it does. <laughs> and when you first set this, set things down a little lower, because on this setting, things are going to come through it a lot louder, and you can really get it real loud and overpower things or get it too loud and it doesn't sound as good. So set things down and adjust it up to your taste. Okay, another way you can wire your pirate speaker up. This is your RCA jack and on this side of it you have such as uh, like your headphones would be. Now you'd simply, just like you plugged into the, the other one, you just simply plug this jack in here and the other one here, and this end will go to your headphone out on your drum module. And that is also another way you can do this. And one more way to hook up your Powerwood speaker. On the AUX input, and that would be where you'd hook your iPod or your MP3 player or something such as that. You simply just need a two, just like your headphone size, I think it's 3.5 uh, stereo type with the three plugs on it. You will need one of them male on both sides and you come to the AUX output, plug into your powered speaker and you come over to your drum module on the where you hook your headphones up and simply plug it into there, adjust it and play. If you don't have all of these cords, when I first got the powered speaker, this is how I used it until I got the uh, bigger jacks and stuff to use. So that is another way as well. And I hope that these ideals helped you out on hooking up to a electric drum set. Now I don't have the setup, but if you are in like a band or in a, and uh, you want to hook up to their sound system, to their mixer board, well these here, the out is how you do that. And uh, which that's a whole different setup. I don't have the setup, but that works great if you're in a band. Everything can be mixed in and to sound and to blend in and get the acoustics just right. I hope that these were helpful. Have a good day. Okay, now let's test our bigger powered speaker. And let's see if there's any difference between the two, although they both work. <laughs>